Hey guys, so this is going to be a pretty, I say boring, I just woke up so I don't know. This is gonna be um, a story of my travels and how it started. So as you guys know, I'm traveling. Some of you know where I'm actually going, some of you don't. Uh, the story is that I met Christian at MEPS and Christian, as you guys know him as Asian Ops, we've been friends ever since. So the nice thing about Christian is that he is a very helpful person. I try to help him, but he denies it. He says, you, you got two kids and don't really worry about me. But every time like that, like he sees that I need something, he's always there like, here you go, dude. Go do something about this and I'll help you out, which is really nice. He, okay, I already got arrested. When I got arrested, it was, you know, it was because of DUI, which is driving under the influence. I was 0 0.06. No, not 0 0.06, because 0.08 is the legal driving limit. I was 0 0.095, which was if I sat down and drank water for literally 20 more minutes, I would have been fine. But the law is the law, and I did uh, not abide by it. So. I paid the consequences. But then he was just like, dude, I know you need to go out. I'll, I'll, I'll drive you. So what ended up happening was for a couple of months on the weekends, I, he would drive me, uh, take me to the club at around nine or 10 at night. And he would literally just sit in the parking lot until I was done. And I'm just like, dude, what time do you want to come home? Like I asked him, like, he's so nice that I asked him like, what time do you want to come home? And he's just like, no, take your time, dude. I'm fine. I got no plans. He literally canceled all his plans. He, he, he usually has plans for the weekend. It was either playing Gears of War because he was going for esports. He was so close and in going into actual an actual event where it's a big esports event. But he would cancel team practices. He would cancel all his like plans for the night until I say like, hey, I don't have plans tonight. So it was actually pretty cool that, he, you know, he's he's just that kind of guy. But getting back into the actual topic of this vlog, he actually told me to plan a trip because he, you know, he he knows that we've been under a lot of stress, especially with my divorce, like um, him just, uh, you know, losing his car because of like a guy who was speeding and hit him and just a lot of things going on this year. And what we, what he said was, we need to go get out of the city. We need a vacation. And I'm just like, okay, where, where do you want to go? Then that's when he tells me he wants to go to somewhere else <laughs> okay um and i was just like cool do you want to go to disneyland do you want to go to utah where, where do you want to go what do you want to do we go camping or something like how long is it? it's like oh this is gonna be like maybe a week or two so not knowing i was planning something like okay well uh where can we go for a week or two that's not going to be hurting our pockets that much and then he goes and then I plan it in September, so that way, because it's only June, so we have July and August to actually build our PTO or a paid time off so we could request it off and still get paid. And um, he said, plan a trip to the Philippines. So <laughs> this is like weird. Wait, um, I need a haircut. So don't mind my hair. A lot of you guys, I'm pretty sure I've been staring at it. Don't mind my hair, okay? Plus I just woke up. That's why I'm wearing a hat. And don't stare at my uh, my scab right here. <laughs> don't. I'm gonna get a haircut soon. And the scab should be gone. Getting back into the topic. Um, so I was like, what, Philippines? I don't have money for that. And then he goes, dude, I'll pay for it. I got you. You haven't been home for a long time and you now have a girlfriend that's there. I was like, what? 
So it literally was the plan. So the plan was to surprise my girlfriend and my mom, my dad, my sisters, and my little brother. Then I was just like, let's plan it in September. Since it's September, my girlfriend's going to Japan for two weeks. She'll be back by then. Here's where the problem started. My girlfriend then goes, I'm gonna stay in Japan for six months. And I'm like, dude, she's staying in Japan for six months. What are we gonna do? And then Christian, knowing him, his like world just lit up because he loves anime. Like he lives for anime, like crazy. So he said, then let's go to Japan then. So that's it, that's the plan. I'm going to Japan, we're going to Japan. Until he started working two jobs, three jobs. That's him, he works three jobs. How do you work three jobs, Christian? How? But, <laughs> and these aren't, it's not even a full-time job and then like a side job and part-time, it's all full-time. Like the last time he did that and we lived together, we only see him like an hour a week and he'll only go home, like, you know to like eat, take a break or something like that. But then, you know, not even an hour he'll leave, go to work. Don't worry, he still showers. <laughs> he still showers. But here's, okay, here's the thing. So now we go to Japan. Then my girlfriend changes plans again. My visa's not here yet. I'm not going to Japan until October. <sighs> so Christian was just like, dude, at this point, you plan everything for you. I'm not gonna be able to go but I will still buy you your ticket. And so this week long drama of me just, dude, you got to go. You have to go, like this was your plan. This is our trip, this is it. Like there's a lot of things that you could see in like, so yeah, so what ended up happening is I told my girlfriend about it and now the plan is going to the Philippines and we're gonna surprise my mom and my sisters and my little brother. Why just them? Because I told my dad. <laughs> mom, if you're watching this, it's already too late. I already told dad. <laughs> just in case like, you know, at least he knows that I'll be there. He knows it's, I'm not just gonna like, you know, surprise with him working. He works a lot. Um, so, that's what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be surprising him. Well, surprising my mom and my sisters and my little brother, not him and my dad. So my mom knows that I'm still gonna go to Japan, which I'm not. Which is really perfect because the flight from San Francisco to Japan is actually Philippine Airlines will land the Philippines and then I will change terminals to then ride another Philippine airline plane to go to Japan. But here's where it's really perfect. The plane that flies from San Francisco to Japan for our layover is actually the plane that does a nonstop flight from San Francisco to the Philippines. Getting it, getting it, getting it. So my mom knows that I'll be stopping by blah, 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 but she doesn't know that I'm staying. Don't worry, I know it's only September 3rd, but if you guys are watching this, I'm already in the Philippines. I'll be there September 13th till the 29th. And if you guys want to see me, comment down below. We'll try to work something out. So that's the story. If you're not subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe click that notification bell. That way you guys get notified when I upload a video. And you guys know this is a series of vlogs while I'm in the Philippines because it'll be me surprising my mom, me surprising my sisters, obviously meeting my girlfriend for the very first time and just a lot of traveling, going to the beach, uh, shopping, experiencing what I used to do um, in the Philippines a lot, which was just go out and do whatever I want. <laughs> My mom hated it. I'm sorry, mom. So, this is it for now. We got T minus eight days and somewhat hours. And uh, I will be vlogging that as well. 
I'll be packing up right now. And if you guys actually look behind me, lots of things to pack. Not a lot, but it's just a mess because I'm still packing and um, yeah. So stay tuned, enjoy the series. I'll be uploading either once or twice a week of this vlogs. Vlogs, when I said vlogs, it's a series of vlogs, that's why. And uh, yeah, so you guys know who I am. I am operations, but yeah. I was gonna say something, but no, nah, I might as well just say it. I already ended, I already started this anyway. Um, and just a heads up guys, I have my phones, one right here, one right here. Uh, the Rilo is still, I'm still a little bit nervous of using the Rilo because it might not save again the way it used to, but I did find a way to get the content out of it, just in case it doesn't save on my phone. But I have a GoPro, I have my two phones. The thing is, audio and video quality will be different just because I have different cameras which allows me to do like, since I have two Galaxy Note 8 and actually a Galaxy S8 Plus, I could actually do three <laughs> different angles. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm gonna kill myself in post and edit this. This is gonna be hard. Um, but for now, I'm just using my phones and once I'm actually, I'm gonna be driving to San Francisco. So I'm gonna be driving to San Francisco and everything. So once I do that, you guys will see the Rilo in action. So this is it for now. I'm gonna say this again. I am Operations. You guys know who I am. I'll always bring you to the top with me. Peace.